hello friends welcome back in today's video i'm going to share another delicious recipe that is egg curry and it's a special egg curry it's a masala egg curry that we usually make in a winter time so before we start the video make sure you subscribe to my channel for more delicious videos uh, every time i post a video you will be notified if you hit that notification bell so first of all we're gonna boil these eggs and once they're boiling we'll start on the gravy so for the gravy we are just gonna take a pan and then two tablespoons of oil once the oil is warm we're gonna add cumin seeds zira then we're gonna add the kara masala um, bari lychee dalchini and um, cloves जिसको कि हम लॉन्ग भी कहते हैं एंड देन वन छोटी इलायची नाउ वी आर गोना रोस्ट दिस फॉर फ्यू सेकेंड्स वंस इट्स रोस्टेड वी आर गोना एड सम गार्लिक एंड देन वी आर गोना रोस्ट दिस गार्लिक फॉर थर्टी सेकेंड्स वंस इट्स ऑल डन वी विल एड सम जिंजर पेस्ट मिक्स इट वेल then we are going to add some green chilies and onions and then we'll let them caramelize um here is a tip then if you if you add a couple of um pinches of salt the onions get caramelized faster so here i'm adding some salt to the onions and here you see all my onions are nicely caramelized and the spices are nicely cooked so once they're all cooked we are going to add our dry spices so we're going to add some turmeric coriander powder some garam masala also we will add tomatoes i took like one and a half tomatoes in here once they're all cooked we are just going to add some water like drizzle two tablespoon of water and um just let it cook so that all the tomatoes and onions and all the spices are mixed well together and are cooked well together so what i'm gonna do i'm just gonna cover it and let it cook for another two to three minutes now our masalas are ready so we'll just gonna mash them up and let it cool for a couple of minutes once they're all cooled down we are just gonna take a grinder and we're gonna grind this mixture all up Now we're going to use the same pan to make the gravy and uh, when we grind up all the mixture we're going to put it back in the pan and then cook it for another 2 to 3 minutes. Once it all cooked for 3 minutes we're going to add some cream or if you don't have cream at home you can add milk, whole milk. That will give the gravy a rich consistency and it will taste really good. So that's what I'm going to do and then I I will cook it for another 3 to 4 minutes. You can keep the consistency as you like and also add salt as per your taste. Now the gravy is ready and we will make the eggs ready. So we peel the all the eggs and now we're going to saute these eggs into um this 2 tablespoon of oil. We're not going to deep fry them because we just want to make it as healthy as possible. So we will just saute them so that the outer skin is all crispy and it will have a nice bite um when you have it in your mouth so it will taste really really good now uh, all my eggs are sauteed well and you can see the outer skin is all crispy so we'll just take them out and slice them into two pieces so there you can see all the sauteed eggs are ready and what i'm going to do is just the gravy is ready we'll just slice the eggs into half and then just add those eggs into this gravy but before we do that we're going to add some kasuri methi to this gravy which going to give it a nice fragrance and fresh flavor so this gravy is ready now now it's time to serve it and make sure that you add the eggs right before you're going to serve it because otherwise the outer skin that is crispy is going to get soggy so here i'm just going to add 
all these eggs into it and my egg curry is ready it looks so delicious so good that you know you just want to see and want to eat it if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and i'm gonna see you in my next video take care bye bye